Hi guys, Ivan here. Sometimes I need to switch my proxy and I would like to have a little uh, system tray icon where I can uh, click uh, and change the proxy settings. I created a little PowerShell script uh, that does this job. So let me show. Uh, so I created a GitHub repository PowerShell tray icon. Uh, first I need to clone the, the repository. Uh, once the repository gets cloned, um, you have a PowerShell tray icon folder and there is the icon tray dot pat, but you can put it into your system or auto start. So by pressing uh, shell startup you can put your icon tray but into this uh, directory and if you log on and log off the shell script will automatically being executed so whenever you log in you have your proxy switcher available um, the, this will actually launch the this um, sysstray tool so let me check the sysstray tool is actually generating the menu structure uh, I have here a proxy Yona with this IP address 100.10 proxy Zurich. So these are not our real IP addresses, but uh, as a boilerplate, you can use that one. Proxy Burn, Berlin, and so forth. So um, is what you need to change the proxy settings in this file. Once you have uh, adjusted this and you also change the path, of uh, the batch file so you need to choose the path where you have the create structure installed uh, this is all in the same folder so i will launch now iconrate.pat the iconrate.pat will now generate the menu structure uh, based on powershell so eventually we get a new icon on the lower so now it appears and as you can see by right clicking I have to see different proxy settings. So let me first check the proxy settings now. Proxy. And as you can see, there is a proxy configured 200.10. So this is a Yona, so I changed to Zurich. Okay. Unfortunately, it is not possible to reload, so I need to reopen. As you can see here now, uh, the proxy has switched to uh, Zurich, the Zurich proxy. And if you want to choose another one, um, sorry, here, one of the list. And if you want to disable the proxy system wide, click on disable proxy. And now uh, it is uh, disabled. Okay. If, uh, if you like this proxy switcher tool based on PowerShell, visit this PowerShell tray icon GitHub repository, check the files and you're ready to go. Thank you for watching. Take care.